is Trey Hardy. I'm the 2012 London Olympic silver medalist in the decathlon. Uh, prior to that, I had two world championships uh, in 2011 and 2009. I'm still the current collegiate record holder and won an NCAA championship uh, while I was at the University of Texas. I've been a professional athlete for almost 10 years now. Being a decathlete, you're never 100% healthy. And, and in training, especially in track and field, there's it's so intense and it's so the pounding you take um, and if one of if your you know your bone structure is off by just a little bit you're going to damage some soft tissue and there's a lot of acute injury involved in that you know I've seen pretty much everything you can possibly see as far as injury goes you know sprains and strains and broken bones and, and uh, torn ligaments and surgeries and everything and, and that's kind of the name of the game you know, as a decathlete uh, you're never 100% healthy you know, if you are, you're, I mean, you're winning medals. If, if you are, you're setting records and you're doing all those things that, you know, everybody just kind of dreams about. You know, this late in the game, my, my health is my number one thing. And it wasn't until I had elbow surgery that I kind of discovered Arasti. I'd seen an Arasti doc kind of walking through the training room um, at the University of Texas and I had seen him work on athletes and I was kind of like, oh, that's interesting. I don't know if that would work for me, but that's, that's neat. And he, he came by me one day and he's like, so how's, how's your elbow doing? And I, I described to him some of the pain and some of the stiffness and some of the scarring that was, that was happening due to you know, lack of range of motion. And he offered to help. He said, you know, let me take a look at it. I'll see what's going on. I can, I'll, I'll feel around and see where you have some adhesion or uh, we can try to work it out if that's okay, if you want me to try it. And I was like, you know, I'm all for it. Because this was around nine months before I was supposed to try out for the the Olympics, try to make the Olympic team, and uh, whatever I thought he could do, I was gonna give it a shot. I ended up seeing him almost once a week for close to six months. It allowed me to do a lot more training, a lot more rehabilitation, uh, a larger volume of what I thought I could, what I thought I was capable of. He kept me in one piece, kept me moving forward. I ended up making the Olympic team, and obviously ended up winning the, the silver medal in London. And it was very much due in part to the, the therapy I was able to get through Arasti. And uh, you know, ever since then, this is my, this is the go-to place. This is, uh, Brian's my, the go-to guy with any acute uh, or nagging pain. I'm coming here to try to fix it first before I seek any other avenues of, of, of therapy or anything like that. And uh, that's what I'd say to, to anybody who is dealing with pain, dealing with chronic, uh, chronic injury, um, is, to, is to look at a Rasti. It's only gonna take a couple of treatments, three at the most, to get rid of it, to, to fix it. And it's, it's a cool feeling and it's really confident knowing that you can walk in here with pain and with an injury and within a few short days you're done, it's over and you're on the other side of that injury and, and you're able to train. And that's really what it's about, you know, for me as a professional athlete is just being able to do my job. You know, if I'm injured or if I'm, if I'm hurt, I'm, I can't do any of that. So. Decreasing the downtime uh, due to injury, decreasing pain associated with that is, is the name of the game and that's, that's really why I choose Rosti.